Baker uh, chose to uh, <clears throat> bowl first, keeping the dew in mind. And uh, there was some dew uh, could see because the mo mops were on. So uh, that is there was nothing wrong with the decision, but uh, maybe the bowlers could have uh, bowled a little better. Uh, but the, that plan was spoiled by uh, especially Harry Brook, who uh, who started an onslaught uh, targeting all the fast bowlers, Sumesh Yadav and Lucky Ferguson early on, and that that kind of disturbed their rhythm uh, as far as bowling is concerned. And uh, it was a fabulous innings from uh, Harry Brook uh, because uh, they smartly mixed all those cricketing sorts with. A very nice improvisation, and his timing was too good. And he chose he chose the bowlers whom he he could target, and uh, to put up two beautiful partnerships with uh, Matram, who also played a very breezy knock, uh, and uh, Abhishek, uh, who came in and proved his captain right. Uh, so the, the two twenty seven was always a. 227, 28 is always a very, very tough target uh, in G20. And uh, a full marks to KKR for chasing, crossing 200 for the third consecutive time. And uh, they did well, uh, but uh, again, SRH, they, they applied pressure early on uh, while bowling and took three wickets within four, four overs. So that kind of, you know, uh, denied KKR a flying start and to put the pressure on uh, throughout the uh, chase. And, but uh, uh, yeah, full marks to Nitish Rana and uh, uh, their new star, uh, Rinku Singh. They never gave up and they kept kept, uh, kept on chasing, uh, took it deep and uh, did a very good job. At least ensured that they, they will not lag in terms of uh, net run rate when, if and when it comes to comes, comes into play. So uh, overall, it's a very good performance, even though they lost, it's a very good performance from KKR. Uh, maybe they could have done a bit, little better in terms of bowling. Uh, they, they, I think uh, uh, Narin, Sunil Narin was the only bowler who was uh, the most economical, uh, considering less than 10. The uh, rest, uh, rest of them scored, uh, I mean, considered uh, more than 10 and over uh, in terms of economy. And that's kind of spoke uh, told the story like uh, they considered too many runs uh, whereas uh, uh, for SRH, Markande and Bhuvanesh Kumar, uh, these two bowlers they bowled pretty well kept, kept it very tight and that kind of you know uh, uh, when you, you win uh, by 23 runs in 200 plus uh, target uh, uh, totals then these, these kind of small small performances make a lot of difference. He had his problems uh, facing spin, whereas he was very comfortable against uh, the Pacers, and he scored maximum maximum of his runs against the Pacers only. Uh, but he's a great timer of the ball. That's why uh, uh, Sunrisers captain Markram uh, promoted him as an opener, and uh, they got the benefits. Russell has been going through some uh, dodgy uh, fitness uh, for the last few years. And with age, obviously, it's going to uh, uh, get worse than uh, becoming better. So they have to, yeah, yes, of course, he is an impact player, not in terms of technically impact player, but he, is, he provides that kind of breakthroughs and scores very fast knocks. So uh, he contributes in one way or the other. But uh, the kind of scenes we saw today, he was not... Uh, of course, fully fit, and uh, that may have impacted his batting as well. Uh, and uh, if, if he was uh, fully fit, I am sure he would have like uh, stole the stole the game away from SRH.